We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. Because he's a big figure out the West. I mean, you said it. No, no he's, that's what I'm saying. He's lost that big figure out the West. He's, he's lost still a that. big figure, though. No, he's I ain't, not. I ain't, no, I'm he's not going to dog him out that way. He has lost it. He has lost the respect of Dr. Dre. He has lost the respect of Eminem. He has lost respect over the years. Like It's like, it's almost like me being a, it's the equivalent of a Meek Mill. Not to put Meek Mill down. It's the equivalent of a Meek Mill. Watching this debacle go down over the years of years of the antics of the game. Wanted to be, I'm I'm my own man. I do what I want. Ba 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 ba. And you're not thinking about the culture. You know what I mean? At the moment, you so caught up with yourself that you're not thinking how this would benefit artists coming up, the next generation. You feel me? Like he's so caught up with that. Now he's trying to be the the apple, the only apple that's not with that. And it's like, well, yo, let me bro, ask you this though. Is all right, but let me ask you this: Is there some? Do you also have, is there a line for you there that's also some respect, though, for for a game in the sense of he got a relationship with Drake, too, so he's just feeling like, yo, I'm, no. you know, that's my guy, this is my guy, so I'm just going to stay out the way. They, no. He wasn't invited, though. That was another that He was wasn't invited. He not invited. No, no. Because... Yeah, but I mean, because of, clearly because of his... Not nah, I me. Mean, his, uh, but yeah, it's, it's more views. than just that. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, right. And it's more than just a Kendrick view. It's a, it's a, it's a Dr. Dre view. It's an Eminem view. Like you just constantly shitting on the people. That's so you. Yo, not, I'm saying so you ain't giving him nothing for. For, nah, I mean, yo, this my guy. That's my guy. I'm gonna stay out of it. No, the only thing I mean, because that's I'm, what he said. He said, yo. Kendrick know what's up. He, he Kendrick know what me and Kendrick got. Yeah. Well, my relationship with him. He said Drake know my relationship with Drake. He said that's day business. I'm gonna stay out the way. That's what he said. I, he he so, said that, but he also, I, you know what? He also said that. See, that's the thing. He said, "Yo, but I did this for this person, and I did that for that person." You know what he was saying? Yo, I'm the reason why this is going on. I did all this before. Yes, you did. Right, right. Of course. But you I also. Mean, yeah, at, at the same token, game has just lost a lot of people in the West respect, bro. And, it, you know, like you said, he can do what he pleases. But as far as him being with this guy right here, that the picture that you hold it up was the king of the West. Like he was the top of the top. There was nobody higher than him from 2005 all the way till Kendrick got there. All the way till Kendrick got there. He started doing funny now, he started doing some funny money stuff a little bit before that, but he still had that persona. You know what I mean? Sometimes the persona of who you are can get you through those tough years. You know what I mean? Like, yo, he's the king. Even though he ain't dropping good music, this guy still has a legacy. But when you start running your mouth, you lose points. It's like, yo, he just was losing points every year, everything. The Dr. Dre thing, saying Kanye West is better than Dr. Dre, and he did more for me than Dr. Dre. That destroyed, yeah, he destroyed his legacy. That's tough. That was crazy. And I'm a Kanye He's destroying his legacy. Even if you, listen, there's a lot of artists that feel that way. Like Jay-Z probably feels some way about Nas still. Or Cameron probably, but you, for, for legacy purposes and to keep things right, you just don't talk that way. Yeah, that's a fact. You just don't say that stuff. You know what I mean? And he has a problem. And this is why he is now... I only thing he got his lyrics and 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 his in his, his great songs now. That's it. Like ain't nobody checking for game. That's why he can't sell a record. He can't move nothing. And he's gonna forever live on. I did this. I did that. That's fine. But you yeah. could have been so much more. Yeah, I fuck. I, I mean, listen. I, I fuck with him before he was the game. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But he was Chuck. You know what I'm saying? Doing freestyles Chuck, and shit. Chuck Taylor, bro. Yeah. This is that guy. Yo, listen. If, <laughs> if Game would have never said anything, and I picked this on everything I love, this is how much I, man, Game would be the number one guy. There's nobody better than Game that came out except for Kendrick. But he would be that. Yo, he would be the king. Like Snoop Dogg is still Snoop. Like when it comes to yeah. Crips in, in West Coast, it's Snoop. Yeah. There's nothing yeah. higher. And he was the Game blood version of that. Yes, he was the. He just okay. 
killed it, bro. Killed it. Destroyed it. Yeah, but and it's way before listen. Kendrick. Yeah, yeah. And and it's not it's like it's just added to it. Yeah, and it's not like we're in a generate we're in a in a, a system right now where it can only be one or two. It could have been all three. It could have been like a big three out of the West Coast. But again, he's done some crazy stuff. The beef with G Unit, the trying to battle Eminem, the statements he made, like you said about the Kanye, the um, all of just fighting people and doing stupid stuff. And then, yeah, he he did a lot of a lot of bozo shit. Um, not saying that he in the street, dude. He, as far as his music career, he did a lot of shit that that wasn't supposed to. Yo, and did how you give somebody a baton? When they, you know, when you know, like, you know, like everybody knew yeah. around that time, Section 80 drop. He just got signed to Dr. Dre. He did a big concert. Everybody came out. He got on stage with that man. This is on YouTube. And you go, hey, man, I'm handing it over to you now. When it's time to stand up for the West Coast. You know where to be found. Mm-hmm. When it's time for you to, you know, what I mean, like that don't that it don't add up. It don't matter if he should. The right thing for him to do is tell Drake, yo, you my man, but. And I love you. You my dog, but I gotta do this for the the, the next generation coming up for the West. This Thanks. is a moment. Thanks. I have to do this, even though I might slide with you on some music. I have to do this for my culture, for my for for the West, because we a whole different. You know, the West got their own deals, their own situations out, their own politics. I gotta do mm-hmm. this for this. And he fell, he, like he always do. Always let me down, and everybody else that support game, all the time, bro. That's tough. All right. Well, you got anything, Wall? No. Good. <laughs> he said he gave room on himself. All right. Well, shouts out to that. Um, Listen, game fucked up. And we're going to And look, the moving. one album, the documentary album that 50 wrote on, he had other albums that were really good too. Yeah. Like, you know, he had a bunch of albums that was really good. But you got like the good three albums game. that I like. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody listened to the game, bro. No more, bro. Yeah, it cause, yeah, what he had um. Devil's Advocate, the documentary, fire. The documentary two was the fire. Documentary two, yeah. Uh, he had uh, what was the other joint with the Jesus piece was my joint. Um, man, Jesus, yeah, it. Jesus piece was a that was an album. That, that, yeah, yeah, right. Well, uh, Jesus piece, Jesus piece yeah. was the album. That was me a bloody joint. And then he came out with another album recently. He dissed Eminem. After he yeah. did Drake, it's like, bro, yeah. come on, 